Alrighty, so here's the front door. Comes right in to the living room. And I have a RoboVac. He's stuck under the couch, but he goes every day. So this is the living room. And then we come in and uh, we have the laundry room right here. We have the laundry room. And then we have the kitchen. And we have the dining room right here. And the fridge. And then this is down the hall. And we have guess, kind of a small guest bath here. I'll show you the shower and the... Nobody uses this very much. I live here alone and I don't have that many sleepovers really. And then this is the master bedroom. There's a master closet right here and the master bedroom right here. Master bath right here. I will tell you that I'm a cleanie and so it always looks just like this. I mean, you know, there's the dirt that comes, you know, here's the shower. The shower is always in pretty good shape. And um, this is the master still. We'll go back out to the hall. This is a three bedroom, two bath house. This is the guest bedroom, kind of a small little just guest bedrooms not used too much. And then my office is right here. So that's what this is. And this is about 1600 feet, maybe 1550 feet. And the gal that's been coming who lives in Easley, who it's just been harder for her to come. She's here for about two and a half hours. She comes once a month. And um, I don't know, what I just need is I need the floors mopped, probably not even vacuumed because they get vacuumed every day by the RoboVac and then um, dusting and the bathrooms. And that's sort of it. She, uh, Linda, my gal who's been coming, she's here maybe two and a half hours-ish. And so that's what this is. So let me know what you think you would charge for this. Um, and like I said, it would just be monthly. And I am in Taylor's, kind of off of Wade Hampton and St. Mark Road. Okay, thanks.